Hey guys, so I'm going to show you a great new battery saving feature for iOS 13 that's going to preserve the battery life of your phone for the next few years. So all you do is you open up your settings. Now if you're not already on dark mode, just as a side note guys, if you're not on dark mode, then this will help your battery as well. So all you do is you swipe from the top right or the bottom up if you're on the older iPhones. And then you hold right here on the brightness and press right here to enable it. Okay, but what I wanna show you guys is a new battery charging feature. So in your settings, you're gonna click on battery and then click on battery health. Now at the bottom here, you guys see this is already on, it's called uh, optimized battery charging. If it's not on, then I would recommend it. So just to explain this, so phones usually take about two to three hours to charge, but a lot of people charge their phones past that, of course. You know, you charge overnight for eight hours, um, stuff like that. Now what the phones do under these circumstances is they'll keep depleting a little bit of battery, so it'll go from 99 to 100%, 99 to 100% for several hours until you unplug it. Um, and that's because they can't actually overcharge the phone. That's just how the batteries work because it is plugged in, but obviously it's not an ideal solution. So what this does is it charges to 80%. And based on your habits, so let's say for example, uh, if you wake up every day at about 7 a.m. So it's going to charge maybe a couple hours before that, maybe around 5 a.m. to 80%. And then it's slowly going to charge the last uh, 20% during those last two hours. So long term, that's much more healthy for the battery than say if it's 2 a.m. and you still have like five hours to go until you wake up and it keeps switching between 99, 100% the premium a little bit and then recharging it. So yeah guys, um, if you don't want this feature, then just turn it off of course. Um, maybe if you have a more erratic schedule and you're always uh, charging your phone for different lengths of time. But for most people, this is definitely gonna save about two to 3% for your battery each year. Alright guys, hopefully this helped out. Thanks for watching. And let me know in the comments below if you have any questions.